Le dying Ebola man. <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Pokemon Clover. I actually did an episode before this, but I got my shit handed to me by Kexander twice and just decided that not enough happened in the episode really and decided to scrap it. One thing that did happen, we took a little trip to the Safari Zone. Um, I wanted to find out what the... Uh, the typing of Cassandra's lead Pokemon was, so I caught one of them. It's a Flow Ray, it's a Poison and Dark type, so hopefully that will help us a little bit in the, uh, the upcoming battle, because she's standing up there right next to the gym, which I didn't see before, so putting off the gym for just a minute, I think we're gonna have to go and uh, beat the shit out of the hell. And then we got Tasty the Crockling, who is Ground and Grass, which is basically the same typing as Douglas, but he's pretty adorable. Mudpants, aka New Sonic, is uh, ground and fighting type. Rico Sheep, he's a normal type, and uh, I named him Suave. <clears throat> I actually found the evolved form a little bit later, and it's called Rico Suave, so I guess my, my naming convention was good there. I think it's an electric type. I'm not really sure. Its moves are like, you know, reversal and mirror coat and counter and stuff like that, so it needs to get hit in order to do damage. Um, I'm not sure if it's like a Wobbuffet or what's going on there. Not really inclined to try it out. Bugsy really looks awesome. Bug and Dragon. Unfortunately, Phil is taking up the Dragon spot. Tic Tac is also a really cool looking bug, but uh, I already have a bug in in Wreck Roach as well, so not going to put him on the team. But I did try really hard to catch this thing, so I named it Balls because, you know, it's made of balls or something. And we got Bon Bon, Normal and Rock, yeah. That's pretty self-explanatory. We can actually make a wonder trade as well, since I have done some grinding. So let's go ahead and, uh, I'm sorry. Sit right here, Kek. We're gonna be back for you in just a minute. I wanna make my wonder trade. I wonder, wonder what it's gonna be. It could be anything. Probably something crappy, though. <laughs> we have half of the, uh, badges. We've got four badges out of, I think, eight. So let's see how that goes. Send Bonbon bon over to whoever. To Botnik. Oh, Botnik! That's pretty cool. It's like that predictive text bot, bot that, uh... I followed the, the Twitter account of that thing. It's pretty cool, actually. Oh, and it looks like we're getting something pretty interesting and new in exchange. <clears throat> what is that? What's that thing? What the fuck is that? T100. It's like the, yeah, the crappiest Terminator. Before the Terminator was Terminator, he was the T-100. Thank you for participating. Oh, my pleasure. Let's see what this thing do. Hmm, steel type. Yes, as I would expect, Galabic. He's got liquid ooze, draining causes injury, acid armor, body slam, flash cannon, gunk shot. Hmm, it's more of a tanky type Pokemon. I don't probably think that I'll be needing it, especially since Decker is a really, really good steel type that's on my team already, so we'll just swap it on out. But yeah, I always like to do those wonder trades whenever they're up. That was a very good suggestion. I can't remember who made that suggestion, but yeah, apparently a lot of Pokemon are only available through wonder trade, so we've almost filled up that first box, matter of factly, so that's pretty nice as well. Let us go try out uh, Kexandra. Her first Pokemon has, like, Substitute, Leech Seed, uh, Sleep Powder, and fucking Sludge Bomb. It's it's really just a horrible combination. So I'm hoping that Decker can take her down. Um, let's see, we've got Shell Smash now. Magnitude not might not quite be enough. Uh, but yeah, I've given Decker a ch Chestoberry? That's what it is. So he's got a Chestoberry now. I should see if I have Taunt or something that would be able to take this thing down. Poison and Dark. It's been giving me a lot of trouble. Return, Psychic, that's not gonna work. Oh, I don't have a whole lot as far as options. That's okay. I guess we're just gonna do what it do. And, uh, yep. Yeah. Cross, cross my fingers, I guess. I, I don't really know. I've... I've had my shit handed to me more times than I, care, than I care to recount, but hopefully a Shell Smash and a Magnitude will be able to do it. Hey, welcome to Esports, Dean. This place is fucking awesome. I spent almost all my money on Safari Zone. You mind if I attempt to beat you so I can buy food to sustain myself? 
Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure, come on. I've given her, uh, probably 2,000 already. <laughs> but she's really hungry. Pokemon trainer Kexander sent out Floray. Oh god, I hate this thing. Decker is immune to its sludge bomb. But yeah, Substitute and all this other crap that it has going for it is not good. So we're going to try out the Shell Smash real quick. Hopefully I'll be able to sweep through most of her team. Uh, yeah, Decker learned Shell Smash while leveling up from 50 to 55. So I didn't have this the first couple times that I tried to fight this foul, foul creature. Um, but yeah, she missed her Sleep Powder. I'm going to go ahead and try an Iron Head. Hopefully that'll flinch and that would be just a beautiful thing for me. Leech Seed? I guess that's okay. I do have the, uh, the Chesto Berry, just in case this thing does hit a Sleep Powder. I'm thinking I might want to Shell Smash again, but I don't want to get too greedy, so we'll just keep going for Iron Heads. I'll keep my fingers crossed that we get a flinch. That would be really nice. Sleep Powder hits this time around, but luckily, I was prepared. Yes, indeed. Fuck. <laughs> this Sleep Powder, like, basically made this thing wipe out half of my team. It was really, really a devastating thing to go up against. So, yeah. I'm glad to have this Pokemon down, one for one kind of shit. Because, yeah, it, it's just super foul. I caught one, thought about using it myself, but its moves aren't that strong, honestly. It just has, like, pretty good defenses and a pretty good, uh, setup. Spagafent! Oh my. Intimidate cut my attack. That's not good. Well, at least we got that other thing down. I don't really want to switch out and waste the, the Shell Smash, though. Um... I don't really know what to do. Maybe I should switch. Let's try a Magnitude. Let's see what Magnitude do. Magnitude 5's not gonna do anything. But I should also try and scout this thing's moves. Oh, it knows Earthquake. Oh my god, it knows Earthquake. That's bad. So yeah, four times super effective against Decker. Decker also had that defense drop on him, so yeah. He keels over. Um, let's see, probably Pecker can avoid Earthquake. That would be a good idea. Alright, get out there, Pekka. Show him what you can do. And Pekka actually learned Brave Bird, which I got rid of Fly for. I'm sure I'll replace Fly uh, back in there at some point. But for now, Brave Bird. Yeah. Super powered with the sharp beak behind it. Fucking knock a hole in this thing. Come on. It did pretty okay, actually. <clears throat> Dazzle Gleam is not super effective. So hopefully I'll be able to live. Very well. And we should be able to KO this thing on the next turn, even with its little leftovers recovery. Where'd you get leftovers, bro? I don't even know where to get leftovers in this game. I should probably look up some guides or something like that, but, um, yeah. I'm not... I wanted to have, like, the new Pokemon experience all over again. So, we got rid of that thing pretty easily. I'm gonna go ahead and try and roost, but this thing is fast as hell. Uses Discharge. Pekka's going down for sure. Oh, well. Um, Tripsius, I think, is, a uh, electric. Electric and... I don't know. But I know Douglas knows Earthquake. That's, that's what I do now, so I'm gonna fucking smash this thing with an Earthquake. That should do quite nice. Douglas also got Anima, Anima, which is, uh, a drain move. Kind of similar to, to Giga Drain, except it has 90 base power. So, that is a really, really nice recovery move to pair up with Drain Punch. And yeah, that fucking thing goes down hard to an Earthquake. It's super, super fast, but also super frail. So here comes the Con Doom. I think that I can Earthquake this thing as well. It's poison and... Poison and water. Yeah, that's what it is. So that thing eats an Earthquake nice and hard. It's going to use Signal Beam on Douglas. I hope that it does not confuse. Should be able to live. Signal Beam's relatively weak uh, as far as power goes. Uh, this thing also has a Citrus Berry on it, which is really fucked. Hopefully Earthquake is going to be able to KO. I could have used Enema and, like, tried to recover my health in order to live another hit, in case it lived. Luckily, I don't have to endure that hit. It goes down to Earthquake. Hell yes! We're fucking doing it. <laughs> I just needed to boost my, my levels a little bit more, obviously. And kind of know what I'm up against. That's important, too. So he sends out Memeness now. I'm going to go ahead and Drain Punch that shit. Normal type? Give me your fucking health. Yum! Oh, that's good. I like that a lot. Go ahead, do whatever you're gonna do. You ain't got shit on me, kid. 
Body slam. Oh, paralysis could be uh, a bad thing. And it crits. And it gets the para. Holy god. I had a full restore, but I used it in the uh, the first couple times that I fought Kexandra, so that's not going to do me any good. So, we've got uh, three Pokemon left. Kek, Mysterio, and Phil. I'm going to go into Phil now, because he's got those fighting type moves as well. And it's same type attack bonus fighting type moves, so that should help me out nicely. He, she's got two Pokemon left, we've got three Pokemon left. I'm liking the way this is turning out, especially since I'll be able to recover a good amount of health with my Drain Punch there. Get out of here! Go on! Fucking cancer! <laughs> cancer memes! Alright, cool. Sweet. Last Pokemon. Here we go, Hitmonana. Should have saved Pecker for this thing. I do have some, uh, some revives and stuff like that, but I'm not going to bother with it. I think an Ice Punch should be able to take this thing down with a relative ease. Hammer Arm could be scary, but yeah. This thing's level 47 compared to my level 55s. So, who knows? Who knows, really? Um, she, she might crit or something like that, but even then I got two more Pokemon in the bag, so... Kexandra, fuck you, bruh. We overcame. As I knew we would eventually, but yeah. I had to pump those levels, obviously. That's alright. I'm glad I scrapped the last episode. Nobody wants to see just a fucking 40 minutes of fails. <laughs> oh fuck, I'm gonna starve to death! Uh, well, here, have some money, I guess. Before I die, I got a little something for you. HM3! A Pokemon I already know, so I don't know any- I don't need any more. I think I might just stick around here for the rest of my short life. HM3? I think that's Surf, isn't it? At least if it matches to the other games. Hell yeah, it is! Do I know somebody who can surf? Only Phil. Oh, that's bad. So we probably need to catch a, uh, a surfy type Pokemon. That would be a good idea. I should also uh, equip my good rod. Register this shit. And I'm going to go in the Safari Zone. I ran out of money. I was going to go in the Safari Zone even more to hunt for stuff, but... Cost 500, and I had... <clears throat> I had 268 before I fought Kexandra, so let's go ahead, we'll play some Safari games since uh, you guys aren't privy to all that stuff that I did before, and yeah, we'll just have a grand old time in the Safari Zone. There's a lot of boxes that I'm not quite able to get to yet, which is unfortunate. I'm not sure how to do so, but I guess it's fine. The mystery will be unveiled at some point. There's a Mud Pants, hey! I, I thought about replacing one of my Pokemon, but the only other ground type on my team is Douglas, and I'd really like to keep him around. Oh, the Stuff Owl. I'll, I'll go ahead and throw a ball at it, sure. Come on, come along if you want. I'll probably trade it at some point, or maybe I'll try and uh, see how it holds up, you know? If it's any better than Pecker, then it can be the new Pecker. Pecker 2, Big Pecker. And Little Pecker. I threw a rock and it fled. Whatever. I don't even give a shit, man. I don't even want you that bad anyways. Ho. <laughs> Hashtag nice guys. Uh, Flowray. Yep, I've got one of those already. I should probably, like, compare stats and stuff like that if you really want to get the good IVs and natures and shit like that, but... I don't really care all that much, if you want me to be honest. There's a Kekroach. My buddy! My little buddy, let's go ahead and try and fish in here. This doesn't take up any uh, any time or whatever. Any steps in the safari zone. So let's see what that be. A titai. Well, hello, little friend. Would you come with me and learn surf, perhaps? I think that would be a nice thing. I don't have a water type. It could be quite nice. Titai. Hentai titai. Very good. Wonderful. Titai are little fishy Pokemon who live underwater. They often swim inside their enemy to attack them from the inside. <laughs> yep, I'll give a nickname. Usually I name my Tentacruel this, but... For now, you can have the name, since I don't think I'll be finding a Tentacruel in this game anytime soon. So there you go. It's not as clever as it should be, but it reminds me of uh, my old pal Tentacruel. So let's see if we can catch anything else here. Not even a nibble. I guess not. Nobody loves me today. Come on, come on! A Pokemon! Yeah! What is it? We haven't done much fishing at all. This is a level 7 Titai. I don't want it. 
I don't want it. We need the super rod. Where can I find the super rod? Aside from in my pants. Oh, yeah. There's the Dray Pillar. Dragon Bug. Oh, God. I wonder what that shit evolves into. It's probably awesome. <clears throat> but, yeah. How many dragon types can you have on the team? Six. You can have six. <laughs> but I don't want to do that. No, no, no. I, I get a little attached to, uh, to my pokes. You know what I mean? I know they're just numbers and binary inside a fucking computer, but I like them, alright? Keck is awesome. Keck and Pecker and Decker and Douglas and the whole team names kind of uh, mesh together, which I kind of meant to do for at least Pecker and Decker. But yeah, all the names kind of are similar in one way or another. This is that fucking flying poison type. I think I caught one of those early on and traded it because it was ugly and dumb. It was ugly and stupid! So I told it, get away from me, never come back! And now, uh, it's dad. It's dad wants a word with me. Oh, I accidentally threw a rock instead of running. You're angry? Are you angry? Are you really? Here, I accidentally threw a ball instead of running. <laughs> That's not true. I'll just catch it. If you want to come with me, I mean, I'll fucking catch it. I got 27 of these, uh, safari balls left. So who knows? Who knows what could happen? It's still angry. Are you really that angry? I mean, you're, you're sticking around, you kind of like the abuse? Is that what it is? You got some, some issues you need to work through with your therapist or something? Oh no, he came with me. Don't worry about that. I abuse him a little bit and he loves me. That's how it works. Having grown tired of all the nutty pee debating in its area, birdmen leave their nesting grounds upon evolving. Oh, that's too bad. What should I name him? Um, I know exactly what to name him. Yes, indeed. He's got like a little comb over thing, so that's that's what we're going to go with. And do I have enough space? Yeah, just barely. You thought it was just going to be Trump? No, it's going to be Trump hair. Trump hair, just like New Sonic. Two words, one nickname. There you go, buddy. Welcome to the team. Oh, there's rock smashy stuff up here. Dang, I don't think I came this way the last couple times I was through. There's a bandash. Hmm, it's a lady bandash. I'll go ahead and catch it. I ain't caught it before. I might as well. I need some fodder for trading as well. Wow, this one really wanted to come with me. All right. BFF? Best friend forever? Or butt-fucking friend? I don't know how that goes. Long ago, Van Dash were imported from another region as slaves. Apparently, they was kings and shit. <laughs> That's true. We was Kangs. And that's exactly what I'm gonna name him. Lou Kangs. No, I'm not gonna do two word nicknames forever. But there you go. Actually, it's a girl. I probably should have named it, you know, Queen Bonquifa or something like that. That would have been pretty cool. Damn, there's so much stuff up here that I haven't seen before. Really, I saw a uh, uh, Honedge. That thing with a fucking blade for an arm that, like, used Swords Dance and swept my entire team. Like a Rocket Boss had it, I think. Oh, it would be super sweet to get one of those. But I'm pretty happy with the, uh, the pokes that I've caught so far. There's a Chestoberry. That's pretty nice. And, hey, that's how you get to this thing. A Bright Powder. Which fucks with the enemy's accuracy, which actually might be halfway useful. I guess. I don't know. I should check out the rest houses, but I'm not sure how to get to that one up on the cliff. It might be just about out of time anyways. I don't really know. I'm sick of seeing these fucking birdmen. I'm gonna go to a new zone. Leave me alone. I caught one already, okay? What else do you want from me? Hmm. There was a rest house there that was pretty easy to get to. But I know what's in there, and guess what's in all these rest houses? Nothing. People complaining. Oh, my feet hurt. Ugh. I'm a fucking butt dick. Yeah. We know, okay? Oh, this is where I got the crockling. He said, Keith. Hey, you said, Keith, Crackley. Hey, we love you, guy. Yeah, we sure do. Hey, there's the Rico sheep, and it's got like a. Oh, Ricochet. It's got a ricochet sound. I didn't realize until I was going to say what the sound was, what the name was actually referring to. 
But it's like, a cow! Ricochet! Ricochet! And it turns into Rico Suave, which uh, I guess I understand too. But I think Rico Sheep is pretty cool. Pretty cool. If it wasn't a normal type, I'd slap it on my team. But what am I gonna do with a normal type? Come on now. Well, I do need some more of these flying types. So I could have a, a fly whore, you know? I don't wanna just have Pecker forget Brave Bird. That seems like a, a big mistake. I don't know what's happening there. Like dancing around. You never gonna catch me! Bitch, yes I am. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. See how you feel about this shit. Yeah! Get this! Right in your stupid face. And then he fled. You could tell that I was not gonna be a loving trainer. That's alright. I forgives you. Oh, but I forgives you. <clears throat> Here's another one. Do you like rocks in the face? Any more than your friend? He's angry now. Uh-oh! He angry! Throw the ball! Hurry! Catch him up! Snatch him up in a bear trap! Oh, that didn't work. And he fled. I don't even understand. Is that like a single evolution thing, or... What is this supposed to be? What is this? Oh, look at that! Singlets! I want one. I'll throw a rock at it, not because I hate it, but because I think it weakens it to capture it. And then bait is like, lets them stay, but also it's harder to capture them. At least that's how I always assume that the Safari Zone works. So yeah, seems to turn out well. Singlets! And then it's gonna evolve into Dubsius and Tripsius or whatever. The numbers on singlets are said to have never matched. It concentrates its psychic power on achieving this. Oh, and you know what I'm gonna name him? Get. Because one day he'll get a get. And won't he be so happy? I'll put two T's because that's cool. Makes it seem more like a name. <laughs> Alright, cool. So at least we caught like a couple new things. Now I'm gonna see some more fucking Birdman, I'm sure. Birdman and Floray. I don't know where that... What's it called? Hone Edge? Oh, that, that little thing is so awesome. It's got a blade for an arm. I want it so bad, but I can't remember where I found it, and, uh, yeah. Maybe I'll find a Chancer, or something like that. Wouldn't that be cool? Yeah, I'd like that a lot. But I'm not having a whole lot of luck as far as, uh, amazing Safari Zone Pokemans. <clears throat> That's alright. Yeah, caught a Bandash. I'm happy about that. I really am interested in the typings. Area 2. Uh-oh, I only have one step left before they kick me out, and I still haven't found what I'm looking for. Make it count, bruh. Just make it count. Yeah, I really want to check the typings on all these Pokemon, see if I can slot some new dudes into the team or something like that. But it's always, it's always hard to say goodbye. Parting is such sweet sorrow, you know? And then once a Pokemon gets left behind, you're never going to use it again. Ding dong, time's up. Safari game's over. Did you catch your fair share? I guess I did. Hey, Kixandra. I, I, I had a Safari game, I just wanted to tell you about it. I caught some shit, just so you know. Just so as you know. Bitch. Haha. <laughs> got him. Fucking got him. Um, we got a couple of fainted Pokemon from fighting Kexandra, so I guess I should heal. Good idea! I don't think they heal just from, like, going in the box or anything like that. Maybe they do! I should do some experimentation with that. But for now, I just want to see what the, uh, the typings of the new pokes that I got are. Hmm. Oh, you got a thing? What, Melberry? Alright, give me this. Put it in the bag. I accidentally did items? Okay, no. Move Pokemon. That's what I want. Titai! What can you tell me? Water and Fairy. Hmm, Timid Nature. I think that's good for a special attacker. Yeah, lowers attack and raises speed. Ooh! Suction cups firmly anchor the body. Cannot force a switch on this little thing. But yeah, Constrict is its only attacking move. Holy shit. That's not gonna happen. 
Well, I do have like water pulse. I actually could probably make it make it nice. You're holding a Pokemon. Yes, I am. How nice of you to notice. Birdman is that poison flying type. Got a sassy nature. Ooh, sassy. Big pecs. Acid spray, drill peck, toxic, air slash. Damn, that's actually pretty cool. I guess because he's a high level Pokemon. But yeah, something that learns toxic. Ooh, I like that a lot. How about Bandash, dark and grass, as I thought before. Uh, defense up, special attack down. Quick feet up speed if it's suffering from a status ailment. It's got sandstorm, cotton spore, bounce, and knockoff. Interesting. Not a whole lot there, I don't think. But who knows? Dark and grass? I'll, I'll have to think about it. Now this, Psychic and Electric, might end up replacing uh, Mysterio. I'm not too sure. Skill Link. Multi-hit moves hit five times. Fuck, that's good. Do you have multi-hit moves? Trigger. Psychic attack gets stronger if used in succession. Then it has Discharge, Zen Headbutt, Thunder Wave. Thunder Wave might actually be cool. But, yeah. I just wanted to have a look. I'm not actually going to snatch him up. Not yet. Not at this time. Not at this juncture. Oh, I, pr I should probably grab Titai, right? And then I can teach her Surf or something like that. But who's going to stay behind? Oh, that's so sad. Alright. Somebody's got to. I'm sorry. I'm sorry in advance to... Uh, Mysterio. Sorry. You're like the new kid on the block. It, he does look so fucking cool, though. Alright, so let's see if we can actually even use Surf, because I'm not sure if we can or not, or if we need to beat the gym first. Probably need to beat the gym. Hentai wants to learn Surf. Yes. Do it! Do it! Do me, do me! One, two, three, and poof! Hentai forgot tickle, and... Hentai learned surf. Excellent. I could also probably give it a uh, EXP share, right? Do I still have that laying around somewhere? There it is. Yeah. I'll go ahead and level her up. Why not? While you're running around with the crew? Maybe get some sweet levels or something like that. Um, and then I remember over this way, there was an ocean. So we might sail the ocean blue. Can, can, can we do it? This can't be used until a new badge is obtained. Much as I thought. Well, that, that got shot in the foot really, really quick. But I had to try it. I had to see for myself. <laughs> because I'm dumb. Alright, so uh, EXP share is going to stay with Hentai for now because I know I'm going to use her at some point. But I cannot bring you with me. I'm so, so sorry. Bring a level 10 into a fucking gym? What are you, crazy? I like you, but I don't like you that way, okay? Alright, let's see about this, this here gym. I'm pretty sure the entrances and exits in this gym are just fucking random. I couldn't find any maps or anything about how to get through it, so... I don't know. I don't even know, man. It's just crazy. This this gym is just randomized as fuck. So, oh yeah, there's invisible walls. Hi, BB. Oh yeah, hi, BB. Uh, can't get through here. Probably doesn't help very much to run. Um, how about up this way? No, are we gonna? And then... Whatever. I didn't get shit. I didn't get shit. All right. Did I fight you? Pogoress is an STD. Yeah, but it's one of the good STDs. <laughs> hey, we're back at the entrance. Super, super duper. I'm just gonna fucking fast forward this until I get into a fight or until we find the gym leader. This is ridiculous. Oh, got into a fight. <laughs> I'll fast forward after the fight, I guess. I'm a reference to something, if I'm not mistaken. Some TV show, I guess. You be the judge of it. Okay, I will! Dr. Quinn Medicine Woman. Hmm? Nurse Jackie. Oh, that's a show too, sure. Sure, sure, yeah. People watch that, I guess. <laughs> we are so over-leveled for this gym now. 
All right, Decker, go ahead. Shell smash it up. Hopefully this thing doesn't have a fighting type attack or else we're going to regret that move. But maybe I'll live. I don't know. I don't know. Decker's defense is pretty good. Hey, it knows cross chop. Fuck. Should have seen it coming. Oh, Decker endured the hit. Wowzers. Wowzers trousers. Here's magnitude. Magnitude 5. Fuck. We're dead. <laughs> and we're dead. That's stupid. I should have just gone straight for the uh, the magnitude, I guess. I don't know. Or switched into uh, Mysterio so he, he could avoid the fighting move. But yeah, what are you going to do? Shit happens, I guess. Get out there, Mysterio. Clean it up for us. Daddy made a mess, and I need your help to clean it up, little buddy. All right? Super. Super duper. Okay. Excellent work. Fantastic, everybody. Toxiraptor. This fucking thing again. Discharge. Discharge. Paralysis. Level 55 against level 48. You're fucked, bro. It's over for you. Get out. Keep your head down. Don't come around here no more. You know what I'm saying? You don't know what I'm saying, because you're a fucking raptor. You're a dinosaur. You don't even speak English. What the fuck is that? <laughs> oh, man. Level 56. I told myself I would stop cursing at some point. I was like, hey, wouldn't it be cool? I wasn't going to say anything about it, but it's it's not working at all. So I guess uh, I'll just forget, I'll forget that I said that. Hey, you forget that I said that too, all right? Just forget I mentioned it, unless you think it's a good idea. I think you shout at me in the comments and be like, yeah, I don't like it when you curse so much, Dayton. And I'll be like, oh. I mean, the way I'm presented now isn't resembling at all. No. I thought Nurse Jackie's played by, like, the Aunt Jackie from Roseanne. Maybe it's just because of the name. <laughs> Why would the programmers make my name a reference and not make my character based on it? I don't understand. Well, that's how most of this game goes. I think so okay let's fast forward some things now and hopefully hopefully it's gonna go just great but probably it's not Oh shit, another battle. <laughs> there does seem to be kind of a, a pattern to this place. House is in the house. Oh cool. It's Dr. House, everyone. Introducing. Yep. Um, but you can also see the invisible pattern on the floor of like places that you can't walk in that giant teleporter room. So that's kind of helpful to me. Let's go ahead and fucking earthquake this thing. Finish this battle out. Because I'm trying to figure this gym out, dude. Do you understand? So yeah, Douglas Grass Ground is actually pretty cool. He's going to be useful for this gym. I thought he was just Grass type, which would make him not so useful. But with all these earthquakes, ooh, buddy! You're fucked. You're all fucked. So I think this is actually the last trainer in the gym. I can't remember how many we fought in the episode before this one. So I'm going to assume that it is... And then in the next episode, we'll have to, uh, to fight the man. You know the man. Kanye, dude. Le dying Ebola man. <laughs> and there we go. Just fucking one-hitting everything with this earthquake. Absolutely insane. Good job, Douglas. He's my boy. He's my special boy. He always has been. He always will be. He's never... My starters never come off the team. They're the Pokemon that stick with me from the beginning to the end. Sometimes things like a Bola Bowl, you know, don't pull their weight, then they get cut. But the starter, no matter what, now they always seem to pull their weight too. I consider that a treatment. Yeah, for your butt. Hey. <laughs> Which is why Arceus created a universe with three states of matter and 300 solid or liquid poisons that could cause his symptoms. Okay, cool. Bye. The fuck ever. Here we go, running through more portals. Awesome, super, great. I 
I don't know how that fucking happens. I have no idea how it happened, but okay. We're at Kanye, so I'm gonna go ahead and, and try and do this. Let's get fucking Decker back on his feet. Uh, cause I don't know if Douglas has enough earthquakes. I don't really know how many... How many Pokemon this guy has, or what's going on, so... It's better to be safe than sorry, I do suppose. And this episode might run a little long, but... That's nothing new, we done that shit before. <laughs> and yeah, I'd rather learn to surf and be on to the next gym sooner than later. So, uh, let's do... I guess Decker first is, is a good one. We'll shell smash up and magnitude. Hello there! <laughs> <coughs> yeah, my gym trainer said I wasn't in good enough health to take on challenges right now. Kanye, you should get that cough checked out. Kanye, you're vomiting blood, dude. You need to go to the hospital. The duties of a gym leader can't wait for anything in their way. Not even disease. So bring it out, trainer! I won't be holding back. <coughs> okay, cool. Look at his face. What the fuck is this? Alright, cool. What's up, dude? How you living? He's got six Pokemon. Good god. Hazmate, level 50. Should be able to take it down. Oh yeah, but this thing knows uh, some fighting type moves. So I'm probably going to want to switch out. Get in there, Mysterio. I'm playing games, alright? Cross chop, and you missed. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah. How does it feel? How does it feel to be predicted so? Huh? Probably not good, huh? <laughs> God damn. Minimize. Oh, that's not gonna be good. I hate it. Let's try and finish this thing. Oh, Aura Sphere can hit no matter what. But I don't think it's gonna be super effective. Let's just try to discharge some more. I don't know if discharge can miss or not. I think it can. I think Shockwave is the one that never misses. But yeah, we'll be all good. Oh, and he's got the pain split. Shit. I don't know if he has anything that can actually attack me, though. I think it's mostly like fighting moves. And even if he has a, a poison type move that can hit me, whatever. That ghost typing is going to resist. Yeah, Mysterio is a good one to bring in here. Krista King. Yeah, I remember this thing. I mean me. Let's try Aura Sphere. It looks like it can be broken. Doesn't it? Ice type? I think that's something that I guessed before. And I'm gonna die to an earthquake. Well, you did a good job, Mysterio. Nobody's mad at you, okay? He just, uh, can't take those physical hits. He just can't. He doesn't have it in him. Uh, we'll go to Douglas. I know this thing will fucking die to an earthquake. It might hit me with some poison moves, but you know what? I'm ready for that, too. Ice Shard. Ooh, I didn't expect that. No, live, live, live! Fuck! What is going on? How did that work so well? I was gonna send out Pecker, uh, but good thing I didn't, because this thing has Ice Shard up its sleeve. What the hell? <laughs> How did that happen? Well, Douglas is gaining massive levels in here. Bulked up as fuck, dude! A bowl of bowl. Poison and dark type? Really hateful. I think I can just earthquake it, right? Nope! It's got flamethrower. Hey, everybody, it's got flamethrower! Shit. So, it's gonna do pretty well against uh, Decker as well, I think. Poison and dark. Hmm. Let's go for Phil. Let's go for Phil! And hopefully a uh, Meteor Mash, Attack Boost, Outrage, and, and then we win. We just sweep and we win, you see? Jesus Christ, that hurts. I'm just really hoping that Meteor Mash does a bunch of damage. Hey, that's not bad, actually. What do you got, Citrus Berry? Nope, just leftovers. Okay, cool. Go Outrage. Outrage now! Oh, God, it's fast, too! I'm sorry, I talked shit about you earlier, Bullable. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. He's in it to win it. All right. Pecker, you got Brave Bird. I know you can finish this shit off. And maybe he's even faster than that thing. I don't really know. I could also use a revive. I would really hate to have to go back through that fucking maze. Oh, how I would hate it. <laughs> I don't even know how I got through it the first time. All right. 
Come on. We can do it. We can do it. Poison point. That's fine. Pecker was going to go down anyways. What do you got? Toxoraptor. I think this thing's super fast too. I think it's all going to end up uh, coming down to Decker. Toxoravage? Oh no! Should have seen it coming. Should have switched into Decker. Rough skin hurt Toxoraptor! Alright. That's cool. Well, let's get Keck in here. I'm going to put Keck in, and then I'm going to uh, go about trying to revive all my dudes. Because I think Keck is the one that has um, the Rocky Helmet. So, Douglas, yeah. Douglas will be a good one to res and maybe fill. But I guess it depends. This dude's using Spore. <laughs> like I even care. Only reason I brought Keck in is so you'd hit him. Or her. And then uh, once you hit him, then, then you'll be hurt. It's part of my master plan, you see. Mm -hmm. I could use a... Uh, whatever you call it. Full heal? Yeah, that's what it is. Unfortunately, Rock Slide is not going to uh, make physical contact with Keck, so my plan kind of backfired on me. But let's see. Let's do Phil as well. Thought about Pecker, Phil. I mean, they're, they're all good pokes. That's why they're on the team. Because they're fucking madmen. But alright, that's fine. Keck goes down. But you made a worthy sacrifice, little friend. Let's put Douglas back in there. Douglas is gonna bring it home! Same type attack bonus earthquakes? What? Spore, I fucking hate. I should have put a Chesto Berry, but I didn't I didn't know this would happen. I didn't know this would happen. I'm so sorry. Um It's faster than me too. This is this is gonna suck. Let's get Decker in there. I don't know if it has anything that's able to hit Decker. Hopefully it's all poison type moves. Toxa Ravage. Ha ha ha. Suck my steel type, bitch. Maybe a little bit of a shell smash. And I might be able to move faster than this thing. That's what I'm hoping anyways. And I flinched. And I got spored. God damn I hate spore. These sleep moves are just... Uh, I can't even words. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I fucking hate it. So, are you going to wake up? If Decker gets a full heal used on him, then he's just going to go back to sleep the next turn anyways. So the only way this is going to work is if he wakes up, uses smell... S smell smash? <laughs> Shell smash, gets faster than the Toxoraptor, and then we could start doing some damage to this thing. But yeah, now my defenses are kind of dropped as well, so I need to watch out for those rock slides because they're doing a little more damage than I'm comfortable with. Magnitude 9! Okay, 8. I'll take it. With the attack boost, we should be able to KO this thing. I do hope. Yeah. Whew! Almost went terribly. <laughs> I might have to use items and kind of cheese my way through this gym, but I don't give a fuck. Oh my god, what is that? Flying poison? Alright, rock blast. Rock blast! Just, just smash it. Smash it out of the sky. Oh, look at how good that do! God damn, Decker! Holy shit! Oh, that that is sexy. I was worried I'd have some trouble. But nah. Not with Decker. Not with Decker out here doing some shit. Magnitude. Seven. Okay. That's fine. Oh, boy. Shit post. <laughs> what a move. Are you, are you okay? Oh, no. It's super effective. Damn, I think it's a ground type move. Well, I guess Phil can come in here, right? Is it poison ground? I don't know why poison ground would resist a ground type move. Hmm. I don't, I don't. I don't. I'm just going to come in here and use outrage. I was wondering if I could use drain punch. Maybe it is ice punch or outrage. Hmm, fuck. I guess outrage has more power behind it, doesn't it? But Ice Punch might be super effective. Uh, I could also just use a full heal and try and get uh, Douglas back on his feet. Or a revive. 
Uh, I just don't know. Outrage. Fucking fingers crossed. I don't know what's gonna happen. Please, kill it! Oh no. This could go terribly. Oh, good. Shit post is kind of like a... Uh, whatever, Rampage or some shit. He got confused. Got a little bit of hyper potion action, though. Oh, this is gonna be a close one. I tell you that right now is gonna be a close one. Damn, outrage again. Yes! Three outrages in a row and the KO. Holy God, that was close. Because uh, I think Douglas was asleep, my last Pokemon. Oh, that was close. I was on the edge of my seat. Holy fuck. Ah, oh, looks like Kanye's unconscious. Could I, could I have my badge? Dayton looted the Ebola badge. <laughs> there we go. Hey, thanks, bruh. Oh, wait, take this too. TM6, is it toxic? Move is toxic. It's really versatile, and almost all Pokemon can learn it. Super. Now, could you go get someone to call an ambulance, please? I'll consider it. Alright, so, we got it done. Hit and run, get it done. Got about 50 guns. Hey, hey, we did it. We beat cancer. <laughs> oh, what a long episode, but we got some nice stuff done that I wanted to get done. So definitely a tip of the hat for sticking around. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I hope that you'll like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. That is always, always appreciated. Uh, as always, we've also got links in the description to Twitter, Discord, Patreon. If you'd like to support me on any of those, that would also be massively appreciated as well. I'd like to shout out MMX Akira and Nico the Legend for uh, being so gracious as to support me on Patreon. And you could be one too. You, get, you just gotta go check out what the tiers are and, you know, pick your rewards. That's how that goes. Anyways. No pressure on that, though. <laughs> Anyways, this has been Pokemon Clover. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator friends. I shall see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. And until then, bye-bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you.